What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Gmaya's World. And right now, what we're going to be talking about is your free Ultimate Legend, which you're going to receive after 15 weeks. It probably will be sooner, depending on how they stagger the Ultimate Legend uh, releases. But we're going to go all of you know go over all of that, and also the creation of Nandi, uh, Namdi Asamoa. Um, the dude, the dude has godlike stacks, bro. Like if you are a 49er Eagle, uh, what's it, 49er Eagle Raider? I think those are the three teams he played for. Um, big body, 99 speed with a full theme team, all that good stuff. We're going to get to that in a second, but I just wanted to go ahead and point this out like I always do. You will have to complete, um, you know, a challenge every week. Uh, they're relatively fast if you, you know, chew clock and go through the game. Yes, they're full games. They always have been. Uh, that's something that we can't really argue about uh, simply because you have to do it for a free, you know, overall player, whatever it is. Um, usually that player is auctionable and it's a random ultimate legend. We're going to go ahead and take a look at everything else that has to do with the Ultimate Legends kickoff. Uh, pretty much, if you want any of the power-ups, I want to point this out as well, uh, because sometimes people go into the auction house and spend a lot of coins uh, when they don't have to, right? Um, you can get anybody's power-up. Any one of the 10 that was released, you go ahead and get their power-ups. Uh, mo for the most part, most of these cards already have their power-ups released. You know, Nandi, Brian Dawkins, Travis Frederick. Um, you guys can pretty much go ahead and get that inside of the uh, auction house relatively cheap because it's already been there. All right. So um, with his, we already have him because we had him on a Raiders theme team. I think we also had him when he was on a Niner theme team, but it doesn't really matter. Regardless of when you had him or whatever it is, you should already, for most of you guys that have Raider theme teams, already have his power up, right? So he's going to actually be one of those guys uh, that we're going to you know, be upgrading in this video uh, and showing you guys what's going on with that, as well as explaining to you guys the whole kickoff ultimate legend situation but i know you guys are mostly here for the free stuff so it expires 220 make sure you do it before then um i will always remind you guys as much as i can to get those done uh similar to what happened with the legend some of you guys were missing out on maybe like one or two tokens and then you tried to reach out to ea help and they were like nah we don't got you um you know pretty much what happens is they want people to take you know advantage of the promo when it's actively going on so if you try to give them like an excuse for like one or two sometimes you might get lucky but in most cases they won't give you the extra token all right so when you go over to the sets right here they've changed it up a little bit right when you go to the exchange right i'm going to show you guys what's going on with this right now after the 15 weeks you'll go ahead and get that ultimate um whatever and like i said it may not be 15 weeks it may be shorter but i'm just letting you guys know that it's telling you that you're gonna need 15 tokens so just put it in your mind as that's the way it's gonna be and i know a lot of you guys are like yo by the time that happens you know what i'm saying like it don't it won't really matter but remember the program continuously goes through that point and what happens is a lot of you guys you pull the most recent ultimate legend that was dropped which cost the most money and then regardless of what's going on you still have a decent time of you know recouping all the cash that you put into the game prior to that uh for those of you guys who are going to get like a the cheapest version you know things happen it's mad you know what i'm saying the luckiest person wins we know how that works also they have a lot of different exchange sets if you have older um you know legend cards that you want to go ahead and see what's happening um you know any legend player uh, ultimate legend player whatever like that um it, it's kind of weird the way that it is because it says legend player but it's actually ultimate legends it looks like so i i don't know what they're doing but no, that, that's a regular legend guy. So why is it, Why I have legend players, why isn't it coming up? That looks kind of weird. I, I don't know guys, I'm gonna get back to you with that. Cause I'm pretty sure I have a decent amount of legend players in my binder, um, but for some reason it's not showing up in that. I, I don't know, we're not worried about that. But anyway, you can go ahead and utilize the regular legend. So it was right. Cause I remember clicking on it before and I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. Cause I know I have uh, regular legends, but I'll check my binder right now. Um, you get an 87, 91 or 95. Obviously, for me, it's probably um, like it's a situation where you probably won't want to put all those legends in there, uh, depending on what the prices of these things are going for. Especially right now, I don't really see the value of all these being like really astronomical. So you may be able to take advantage of it. But I'm going to check my binder right now uh, just to make sure because I know I pretty much had some decent stuff going on right there. What just happened right there? Oh, they tried to give me a free pack, but it didn't. It's not going to be in there or something. Is that what just happened? Yeah, it, it, it's like a welcome ultimate legend pack. What happens is I was already in ultimate team when the promo dropped. So even though it shows three right there, it's still not going to give it to me. I have to reset the game and do all that crap to come back and get it. I'm not going to do that right now. So just so you guys know, you will be getting like a, you know, a welcome pack. Nothing really big. Uh, probably just something with Brian Dawkins on it or some foolish just like that. And that most of you guys are going to quick sell. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go to program. We're going to go to regular legends. And maybe I don't have any more. Okay, so, oh, okay, I have the higher ones. 
I have the higher ones, the 86s and the other stuff. So I must have put those in the sets to get the Kyle Williams and the Robert Mathis and the Morton. And okay, I, I already used them in the previous one. So if you guys have any of those other legends, you, if you wanted to, you could go ahead and see if you get lucky, which most of you guys will and get a 95. As far as what's inside the store before we go ahead and uh, complete uh, Nambi uh, Asamoa, you're gonna go ahead and see these bundles in there. Um, it's solely up to you guys how you wanna go about this. Uh, this is the first drop, so I don't know if they're gonna go, if, is it gonna get more exciting? Like, are things gonna get crazy? I don't know, they have the uh, training variety pack. It's been all over the place uh, circulating uh, since yesterday. They got the 83 plus Legends player. If you wanted to flirt with that, yes, you can pull, you can pull the full Legends out of that. Uh, for those of you guys gonna be asking about it, absolutely, 100%, you can. Um, and that's pretty much it. As far as I know, there's nothing for competitive. So if you wanted to go ahead and do something with that, you could. Um, you know, based on everything that's there, I would go ahead right now. We're gonna go and take this right quick and then see what's going on with it. We're gonna go ahead and get our weekly pack. Usually it's pure trash. Did they give it to us or did it just, I don't know what they just did right here. We gotta go ahead and check this real quick. Let me see what just happened. Because with this one, you know, we probably still, yeah, we still, it looks like we still have to reset it because they're not gonna let us like get it because you have to pick one of the three. So everything is just kind of like really, really like, it, it's really, really bugged out right now. This happens regularly. It's something that they've been aware of, but I guess for whatever reason, they just don't know how to fix it. Or maybe they're just putting it on the back burner. But when you're already in mutt when a promo drops, your packs will not show up. All right, and also guys, remember, there's gonna be a lot more going on as far as people that are getting raid sold and removed, and I will keep you guys updated with that. But we're gonna take a look at Nambi right here before we go ahead and update his card. Uh, just to give you guys an idea of what's going on with it. So you're gonna need about, what is that? You need, uh, what is that, 17,800 training to get him to that point. Now when he gets to the 95, obviously he's gonna have, bro, he's gonna have 99 press. His card is probably really, really wild. Let me let me go ahead and do this part right now though, because I already have the, um, the cards that go into a set. So we're gonna go ahead and just do this. And then I'm gonna go over and uh, complete his set. But I just wanted to give you guys some insight into what's going on. His card is outrageous, bro. It's really, really ridiculous. And he's the only one that I really have my sights on right now at this moment. I know you guys saw my packs that I had to Aaron Donald. Um, I'm gonna take a look at him as well to see if we can utilize him uh, in our defensive strategy. But as far as uh, the cornerback goes, I gotta see who we're getting rid of. I'm just gonna be totally honest with you. There's been a lot of guys that have been playing like garbage. Rod Woodson is one of those guys. He sucks. Um, I may have, but like I said, I don't know how we're gonna work it. We'll go over here to, where is he? Namdi. Um, there he goes right there. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're going to go ahead and complete uh, this guy's uh, whole set right here. And to, to, if you guys wanna know what it cost me, I think for all of his cards, maybe like 500K, I think it was like 500K or something like that, it cost uh, when it first dropped. Uh, his card, his main 95 was like 290 or something. I expect it to come down in price uh, because people are gonna be pulling it or whatever's gonna be going on. But you know, I had to get him because I needed a, look, my cornerbacks have been playing like garbage. So I have to do something about it. So right now he's up to 519. So I got him for 290. It's, it's not a big deal, guys. Like, you know, that's why you gotta get out there early when people are actively pulling packs, um, if you can, um, to go ahead and grab it. So now we're gonna go ahead and upgrade him. I'm gonna show you guys his numbers, uh, give you guys some insight into what's going on, and then we'll pretty much go from there. So um, here we go right now. We're going to um, go back into the lineup and we're gonna upgrade him. Now, I know what most of you guys are saying. Yo, Jimai, after they give us those 15 tokens, you know, guys like Namdi, you know, they might be outdated. Well, that's yes and yes and no, because it depends on how the game goes, you know, forward. You know what I'm saying? Like, they can do a lot of different things right now, um, but some of the cards, if they do golden tickets and stuff like that, it's automatic that a lot of these cards are not gonna retain what their value should be. Um, I, hold on, who are we gonna get rid of? I guess we can get rid of, um, oh, DRC, dude. Yo, DRC gonna have to go for now. For now, DRC may have to get rage. Like, just it's not gonna work out for him. But let me give you guys his numbers, right? So, 99 speed, 99 excel. All right. Remember, he's on a he's on a full theme team, so he gets that additional stuff. 99 press, 99 zone, 99 man, 99 play rec. His agility is off, but who cares? 99 jump. This card is ridiculous. All right. Now, is he gonna play up to par? Probably, dude. Listen, he's gonna get. I don't want to tell you the stuff that's going to happen to this guy. Like, the things that's going to go on with him, it's going to make me very, very upset um, just to just think about what's going to happen with him. But it doesn't really matter. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, regardless, we're going to have the best corner right now. You can also see he has four ability slots. Um, for us right now, we're just going to give him that deep route KO. 
and then we're gonna have to take it off of somebody else. We're gonna also, like I said, I'm thinking that it's gonna have to be Dominic Rogers Cromartie, because he's like the odd man out right now. So we may put somebody else that's not as good in not in um in Namdi's position. Uh, I mean in uh you know I'm in uh, DRC's position. I meant to say. So let me just take this off right here from him. We're gonna go ahead and remove this real quick because he won't need it. This guy will not be playing football for us uh, for any um, time coming in the foreseeable uh, foreseeable future. So what we're gonna do right now? Um, like I said, I'm not gonna raid sell him because when he gets his next card, he's gonna be OP. But we have to figure out how we're going to work the four corners, right? Dion, Rod, Charles, and Namdi. Now, I have a feeling I should probably put Dion Sanders um, in the slot. Because he, you know, the slot guy is the most dangerous guy, and they're going to cheat you in the game. Like, he just won't, like, DRC be getting burnt like toast. And obviously, he's a, whatever speed he is, he sucks. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Okay, Rod Woodson. You've been kind of trash over the last couple um, games also. Charles Woodson is garbage too. But I'm feeling like I like having Dion. I like having Dion um, you know, play the outside. But now that we have two 99s, I feel more comfortable putting no. I guess I'll leave Charles. No, Charles Woodson be getting dealt with. Regardless of the situation, we're not gonna leave Dion on the outside simply because he's Dion and he'll be able to take away, you know, one of the slot guys that have like route tech and stuff like that. Even if he gets routed, he'll be around the area. And that's pretty much all we look for. So he's gonna have to probably take the third route. We'll put Charles Woodson, we'll, we'll put Charles Woodson, Charles Woodson as the fourth uh, corner with deep route KO. And uh, we'll work that. So we're gonna substitute in its entire depth chart, you know, just so that he's there in the slot. And then Charles Woodson will stay back there. And then we're gonna figure out who to give that old, um, the universal coverage to, because Dominic Roger Kamardi will not be playing for us right now uh, until further notice. So maybe we give it to Namdi. We'll go ahead and give it to Namdi. That way um, it works out for us. So what we're gonna do is Dion and Charles Woodson. All right. And remember, this is subject to change. I'm gonna see how they play and then we'll figure it out. But we'll take the universal coverage off him and we'll give it to Namdi so that Namdi can just be all the way souped up. He gets a pick, it's GG's in the chat. So that's where we are right now. Um, let me know what card you're looking to get right now. I have a lot more work that I have to do. There's some things that I have to adjust. Um, I will keep you guys up to date with it. I just wanted to get that out to you guys. Make sure that you're taking advantage of those tokens. Go ahead and make sure that you complete that challenge once a week and you will get that free player, uh, you know, Ultimate Legend player at the end of the promo. I want to thank you guys and girls for watching. Go ahead and have yourselves a good day. Until next time, one love, y'all.